Hey everybody, welcome to Mere Minutes, the woodworking show where I don't do any woodworking. If you're new to the show, here's some highlights. What's up, Mimos? How, how are you doing? Are you looking forward to the Super Bowl? Do you want to hear my prediction I made back on October 4th? Chargers and Seahawks. And there you go, I called half of the participants in the Super Bowl. Kind of screwed up on that Chargers thing. So it comes down to Seattle and New England. Ho-hum. Did any of you predict the Super Bowl back in October? I had a question about Friday's project, the little caddy for holding, well here it is, right? For, <laughs> for holding rags and, you know, paint brushes. Why I, I had a shot in there of sanding the MDF and why I sanded the MDF. You're right, you don't have to sand in MDF. It's one of the reasons I like MDF is because it's already smooth. But I also like MDF because you can sand it and it's great for spots where, say those, those rabbits, yeah, say where those rabbits weren't exactly even or didn't mesh up correctly. Wow, you can just sand that smooth so easily. It can make you look really good. A lot of people always ask me about the colors of paint that I choose and all I do is I just use regular latex paint that I have lying around. This is paint that is from our living room. One of the walls in our living room is painted that color. For me, I'm gonna spend so much time in my shop and everything is kind of, you know, wood color. <laughs> and so I think it's nice to have some, some bright colors. They, they make me happy. You know what I've been doing? I've been trying to watch all of the movies that are nominated for Academy Awards this year. I wanna see all of them. Boyhood, excellent movie. Excellent, excellent, excellent. If you get a chance to see Boyhood, it's an amazing film. They took. I guess 12 years to shoot this with the same cast growing up, you know. I saw the Grand Budapest Hotel, which was fun, great cinematography, but I, it's not gonna win Best Picture. American Sniper was a really good movie, but I felt like I'd seen it all before. It was, it's basically the exact same plot as The Hurt Locker. So if you've seen The Hurt Locker, this one, it seemed like almost a remake of it, but it, it was good. But the one I like the best that I've seen so far is Whiplash. I just saw Whiplash a couple nights ago and oh my God, what a great movie that is. It's one of those movies that I just kept thinking about the day after I saw it and it's just the intensity of it. My, my stomach was like in knots watching this movie. I didn't know what was going to happen next, but if you get a chance to see Whiplash, go see it. Still have a few more to see. Still need to see Selma. Birdman, uh, the Stephen Hawking one, and then the the Cumberbatch one the, about the Enigma machine. That one looks really good. On a quest. I even saw one of the foreign films, Ida. Are you guys getting tired of my shop organization projects? <laughs> I'm kind of getting tired of them myself, but I think my shop is good enough right now that I can move on with my life. So I think that this coming week, I'll do a different, I'm gonna do another storage and organization project. I'm thinking about doing a, a shoe organizer. They seem to be really popular. A lot of people have been posting shoe organizers on the website. Uh, so I think, I, I think I'll do that. We could use one in our master bedroom. Our organization of shoes right now is kick them off and throw them on the floor. Grumpy Cat was in the Bay Area yesterday. She was out in Berkeley signing autographs, I guess. I don't know. Would have been fun to see Grumpy Cat but I didn't get the chance to. Hey, did you guys get a chance to see my new show, Mimo's Make? I posted on this channel earlier in the week. It was uh, Wyatt and I, we were uh, discussing projects that you've made. I thought it would be fun to just show off some of the really, really cool stuff that you guys are posting over on the website. The projects you guys make are, are great. It just gives me a lot of inspiration to come up with, I like the shoe rack, you know? I see, wow, people are posting shoe racks. This must be a thing. And so I thought, well, yeah, I'll make a shoe rack. I think that's really cool. And so. Eventually I may ask some of you if I can make some of your projects that you're posting on the plan section because there's some really cool, cool plans over there too. And there you have it. See, there, there wasn't hardly any woodworking going on in this show, was there? I'll see you guys next week.